fall of the Templars a dark chapter in history. October 14, 1307, a date etched in history witnessed the downfall of the mighty Knights Templar. In a carefully planned political move, King Philip IV of France orchestrated a series of events that would lead to the dramatic demise of this once powerful organization. The day before, the Templars' headquarters had been raided, resulting in the arrest of 15,000 members. Now King Philip needed public support to legitimize his actions. King Philip, portrayed by William, addressed the public in the garden of the royal palace and listed the charges against the Templars. Crusades, heresy, immorality, the public swayed by these claims rallied behind the king. The clergy joined the king in condemning the Templars. Propaganda spread, even turning the Franciscan and Dominican orders against them. Philip sought aristocratic support by emphasizing the Templars' tax exemptions. Negotiations ensued, and the nobility reluctantly sided with the king to ease their tax burden. The Inquisition trials began on October 24, 1307. Torture was used to extract confessions, resulting in the deaths of 34 Templars. The Catholic Church, at first silent, was forced to act. Pope Clement issued an edict to stop the Inquisition, but tensions escalated. Accusations flew between the Pope and the King, leading the Pope to declare King Philip excommunicated. On May 6, 1312, Pope Clement issued the Vox in Excel, which officially dissolved the Knights Templar. Their property was transferred to the Hospital Knights. In the aftermath, the Templars faced different fates. Some confessed, some joined other sects, and some went into hiding. England, Italy, and Portugal reacted differently, with some Templars finding refuge in Spain. Officially dissolved in 1312, the once powerful Knights Templar left a legacy that continues to intrigue and fuel conspiracy theories. Their story, the clust in history, echoes through the ages. Thank you for joining us on our journey into the mysterious world of the Templars. Comment below with your suggestions for future historical series.